Okay, so here is the big reveal. I had my Mohs surgery on Wednesday. I was told to keep the bandage on all day Thursday and I could take it off Friday and shower, uh, clean it up. And basically that's it to have this um, ointment. They gave me this to um, take a Q-tip and go over the sutures uh, twice a day. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. some tape. She told me I don't have to bandage it, but who wants to look at this? So I figured if I go out, I'll cover it up a little rather than, uh, you know, make people sick by what they'll see. Here's a Band-Aid. I don't know if it'll work. And this is just gauze to clean out the wound. Now, another important watch is this Hibbic Cleanse. This is good for any wound. Um, just wash it out. Uh, it's red in color, but it doesn't uh, dye anything or turn anything red. Um, it's just a good idea to use this if you're going to touch any open wounds or you want to wash them out. And this is what I'm going to use to clean this wound. Off camera, I have a plate of water. Yeah, let's see what this gauze looks like. Boy, this is exciting. So I guess it's common sense that says sterilize your equipment. Um, I don't plan on going anywhere near my eye or my wound with the scissor, but I'm gonna be cutting stuff that will. So I'm just gonna bathe this in alcohol. Make sure I get this nice and clean. And that should be good. This was already sealed and packaged. My hands are clean, they're sanitized. And here's the gauze that I'll clean out the wound with. with this uh, HIPAA cleanse. Okay, here we go. Ah, feels good already.
sticky. So here's the gauze. Oh, good, pop right off. Not too much blood. I don't know if you all could see that. Looks pretty nasty, to be honest. So using the gauze. Not too bad. Definitely sore, and not too much is coming off, so that's good. Get some of this Hibiclen soap. See the color. The hole is like right about here. I might even take a shower. Said it's okay to take a shower, let the water hit it. But this looks pretty clean. I'm gonna use a fresh gauze. At no time did I go back in the water with um, after I touched my nose. So I won't put this back in the water. And I just want to soften up any crusties that might exist. I can't tell what's in here. Just press a little dab. Mm, that's a pretty clean gauze. I think I'm happy. How's it look? Um, now we use this. Twice a day. I guess in the morning and before I go to bed. Uh, this has one of those seals on it. And usually, if you turn the cap around, um, there's something in there that'll pierce it. So, here we go. It's pierced. It's almost like A and D ointment.
I'm going to switch sides. That's it. So maybe in a week or two, I'll do an update. We can see how this thing is healing, but all in all, it looks pretty good. Very happy. It's a little sore, um, tender, not too much pain. Yeah, it's good. Okay, thanks for watching. I hope you got something out of this. You can see it's pretty easy to um, take care of. So, any questions, I'll be happy to answer them. Uh, any advice, I'll be glad to take that too. Okay, good day to all. And good luck to you um, if you're scheduled for this. It'll, it'll turn out fine.